By the way, that which reminds me, speaking what? of skunks, uh, when this when this Godfather, the former head of the Bonanno crime family, what's his name, Bernie? Messino. Joe Messino. I mean, uh, when he starts singing. Uh, I should start dancing. <laughs> no, but I mean, uh, so I called you because I'm, you know, all those guys. Uh, uh, what, what's your? What, you know, you know, my what, take on the whole thing is. Yes. What is your take? Organized crime. If the FBI would. That's use, not right, is it? Well, you know what's not right. If the FBI would would use some of this energy, and I have a lot of friends in the FBI, let's use it towards the terrorists. Who cares about Pasquale Pizza Man, Joey Tomato Balls, and Meatball Head, and all this? You know what they're doing? They're doing their little thing. It's about decimator right now. The organized crime is just about decimator. Stop paying attention to uh, other groups of organized crime. How about the terrorists? Let's pay attention. Speak. Well, yeah. Well, conversely, though. If uh, if these organized crime families are jacking up legitimate businesses and making them pay protection and that sort of thing, that's that's not good. Well, the majority of these crimes that you re- re- read about, Messina and all, and gorgeous, uh, uh, the guy, uh, what's yeah, pretend like Vin- you don't Vinny know. Vinny gorgeous. Yeah, Vinny gorgeous. The drink will be at Rayo's. Not a bad guy. Very nice guy. Yeah. But the point is, they did that amongst themselves. You want to yeah. join that group? You want to cut your blood? Burn the card, the the Joker card, whatever they do. You want to become an organized made member, then you're gonna live that life. And if you're gonna get whack, you're gonna get whack because you join that life. They don't bother too many people on the outside. If they bother people on the outside, they know now they're gonna have the FBI breathing down the back. With that said, they can use this energy for the terrorists. Speaking of terrorists, so my my position is though, yeah. And there's nobody more pro cop than I am. Yeah. However, if you're in the if you're in the Godfather, you're in organized crime. You can't. You, you got to shut up. Well, that, well, that's the point. The point is, he's the head. Of, he was the head of the banana fair. When he starts ratitating, it's all over. Imagine when the wise guys go to shake down somebody, they're gonna go, ha ha ha! I got a piece of cheese for your boss. My point again: we should use some <laughs> well, of this. What energy. does that mean? Rat. Rat. Oh, rat, I, oh, rat, I think. Uh, King <laughs> Abdullah. You're not even talking about <laughs> King Abdullah. King Abdullah is over in Saudi Arabia. Mr. Gates. Well, what's going to happen to the Godfather for ratting? Well, he's going to be put in a witness uh, a witness protection program. He'll be fed a lot of cheese, and then and he goes away. Bye bye. He, I think, only killed seven or eight people. They make deals with him, like Sammy Gravano killed nineteen. Like that punk, that elite punk that, that said that he knew me that I never met in my life. Right. This punk killed twelve people. They were trying to make a deal, and then J- John Junior Gotti was acquitted because of that guy because they knew he was a liar, right. and that's why Gotti Junior was acquitted. Yeah. Let's get to the Abdella King Abdella. Did you see this thing from Staten? Island of the four or five women who are uh, mob wives. That's a new reality deal. Uh, yeah, that's by Harvey Weinstein. I love Harvey. Did Weinstein. you see that, Bernie and Lou? I didn't see the show. No. no. Well, some tough. There's some tough girls there. Well, you know what? I know something. <laughs> some tough girls. <laughs> the only come thing, on, baby. The only thing is <laughs> oh, Sammy Gravano's daughter's in there. You know, if you sent my daddy away, or well, some my tough dad. women. Yeah, they're tough women. Oh man, come yeah. on. I mean, you just don't want to say. Just like, hey, how are you, man? <laughs> <laughs> Secretary of Defense. Uh, Bob Gates, right? Sure. He went over to Saudi Arabia. We don't have a lot of With a letter about. from the President of the United States. He wanted right. to see him. They kept him waiting for three days. They wouldn't let him see him. <laughs> King Abdel is pissed off because of... I don't think we need that kind of language. Well, King Abdel is upset about one thing. We gave up on Babarak in Egypt. We left him like uh, like El Quico when the attack happened. We wanted huh. democracy. So King Abdel says, you know what? I don't want to talk to America anymore. They turned it back. Look what America did with Baharan. When Saudi sent the troops to protect uh, Baharan, he, all of a sudden America's opening right. their mouth. We have no allies. Gotta go. We have no allies. These are our allies, Saudi Arabia. Is it supposed to be? Let the me, problem uh, here is they pump the oil up. You see, that's why we're paying more at the pumps because King Abdullah says, gush it out. Pull it back. You know what we should do? Take our troops out of here. Take our planes out of the airfields. And you know what? Let's come home, boys. Let them Final. fight for themselves. If they want to raise the oil, let them raise the oil. Why are we protecting them? Final Remember question. when Saddam Hussein came? Final question. Kuwait? They was going to Saudi Arabia next. Final question. <laughs> Will Trump run? I don't really, honestly, I don't think. Yes or no? Yes or no? I tell you Yes or no? At first, I said no. But God, you want yes or no? Him? I think that Donald Trump... Would be a great fr- a breath of fresh air. I didn't ask you that. Corruption in Do Washington. Do you think he'll run? I support him today. 